Are you guys sick of talking heads telling you what you need to buy? I am too. However, I got a deal that you gotta hear. CE Ferulic Acid Serum Triple Lipid Moisturizer with my new online store, Skin Medicinals, for just $75 each. That is over 50% less than common serums and lipid moisturizers that are on the market with the same quality. Check it out in the description. You're gonna see a discount code and you're also gonna see the link. Come check it out. Thanks for popping by. Okay guys, Mr. Pops it here. We can see we have a small abscess, a medium-sized abscess uh, history of hydronitis superativa is fairly severe. These can pop up anywhere. We can get pitted scars. Um, and this is a pretty simple, just numb on the surface there. We'll make a tiny cut to drain out the fluid pocket, give them a little Kinelog injection. This has been building over the last couple weeks. And they just get bigger and bigger until they thin out and then get more painful. So it's good to numb them up, do a little drainage, get that anti-inflammatory in there um, before it gets even worse. So thanks to him for sharing. We'll get him prepped and ready. Be right okay, back. So we have him nice and numb here. It's just a little fluid pocket. We're going to do a small poke. Shouldn't feel much. You okay there? No. Okay. There's the pocket. There it is. You can feel right when we hit it there. Put cause down there to catch it and just a little bit of pressure. Sometimes these will be, it's called loculated. So there'll be little multiple pockets. So we come from different angles. And there's a little fluid pocket right there in the beginning. You okay with the pushing mm -hmm. a little bit? It's coming out. That's, um, I like to use something with a blunt tip. We just kind of disrupt a little. Any pain, let me know, okay? Me Sorry. Try. A little bit? No. Good. Just go in to break up any small areas. called loculation. You can feel a click there. They're like little membranes that kind of hide little pockets of purulence, which is pus. You okay there? Mm -hmm. Good. Kind of roughing it up just a bit. This is what hydronitis does gets in there and kind of makes little sinus tracks sometimes. Sometimes little cysts form as well. Oh, it's starting to flatten out. He's got a little bit of puffiness there just from the uh, Lidocaine I put in because that puffs up the tissue, but the initial pocket of fluid definitely went down. If I'm pushing too hard, just let me know. I come from every angle here. Good, that's flattening out. Then I'll put just Kinelog in that pocket and that'll take it down. I'm going to make sure there wasn't any other pockets of pus in there. It's looking a lot better. Yeah, I don't feel anything right here. Sometimes it'll go down and trace in front of the ear there. But he's looking good. As I just open up the exit here just a little bit as I push. Make sure nothing's getting caught there. Just a little fluid. You okay there? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, yellow starts to turn to just kind of bright red blood. It means we just, in the bottom of that pocket, 
a little inflammation will start to leak a little, but that's it. Okay, put a little pressure bandage on here. Just gonna go deep in here. A bit on this side too. There we go. Okay, so just a little tiny cut that'll hide right the hairline there. It's only two to three millimeters. We've got all that pressure released, and then now that anti-inflammatory in just a couple days will bring that and flatten it very quickly, and that should be under control for him for quite some time. So thanks, Tim, for sharing. Thanks for popping Hey, back. guys, I always like to do a little follow-up. Um, we had a hydronitis abscess here. We drained. You see a nice little scab just where the little cut was and where it was draining out of. We did a little injection there, softened it up completely. That bump is gone. This scab will fall off in the next 7 to 10 days. Um, now, this would have gotten to this place usually on its own after a couple weeks, but if we can speed that up within just like 7 to 14 days, sometimes even quicker, they go down pretty quick, dry up, scab falls off, and he's good. So thanks to him for sharing. I just wanted to do a quick follow-up video on that little IND drainage we did with an injection.